Space has been in our headlines a little extra lately, or at least it feels that way. It's rapidly evolving, and it feels like every other day there's a space launch. But it all started somewhere, and that is with the International Space Station. The first piece of the International Space Station was launched 25 years ago this month, actually. Astronauts and cosmonauts have been living, working in the space station since the year 2000. And if you go outside today, you can actually see it. If your eyesight isn't the best, NASA launched an app that helps you spot it. Joining me on how to explain how the app works is the app's NASA project manager, Allison Wolf. Allison, thank you so much for coming in to chat with us this morning. This is exciting. It is exciting. I'm, I'm really happy to be here, Zach. I, uh, my producer is especially excited about this. She texted me at like 5.15 this morning telling me that I had to download this app. Yes. Um, and, and so <laughs> I did, half asleep. I'm like, I don't know if this is working, uh, but we, we got it. It's on my phone. Tell us all about the app. Where did the idea come from? So the idea is really about letting the public know about the wonderful benefits of the International Space Station. Many folks don't realize that 250 nautical miles above our heads, wow. there's an orbiting laboratory traveling around the Earth at five miles per second. Wow. Yes, and we are really excited this month because we are celebrating 23 years of humans living and working on the International Space Station. So what that means for your viewers that are 23 or younger, like my three girls, oh my uh, they've never lived a day on Earth where there Without, has not yeah. been a human in space. Wow, yes. that's pretty incredible. Yes. And the work that goes on there is out of this world. Literally, yeah. literally thousands of scientific experiments have been performed there. But the other thing folks may not know is that you can actually see the space station from Earth. Wow. Yes, and the trick is knowing where to look. Where to look. Right, so that's where Spot the Station mobile app is the perfect tool for you. Okay, yes. so I don't know how um, we want to do this, but if you go to wherever you um, download your apps. Yes, iOS app, and Android. Yes, yes, in your respective app stores. It is free. It's free to Absolutely, download. Absolutely, yes. Uh, and it's a really cool icon. I don't know, Rich, I'm not sure who... <laughs> It's called Spot the Station. I have so many apps on my work cell phone that it's this is pretty messy. I'm embarrassed to show. <laughs> I'm embarrassed to show this actually. But it's it's a really cool icon. The icon is blue and white, and it's the space station. It it's is the ISS. It is Spot the Station is what it's called. So you open it up. Yes. And walk us through what it is we see. Okay. So right here you have a view of the globe, and you can actually see the space station's trajectory around the Earth, and you've got a flat view as well. Okay. Awesome. Um, but the thing that's really cool. Yeah. Yes. is that we've built in an ag augmented reality component where you can find the station anywhere on Earth. So right now the station is below us. <laughs> it's south. It's in the yeah. southern hemisphere. Exactly, exactly. Or beyond the Exactly. So you can track it Wait, so how do you, at any oh, time. Oh, very cool. Yes, yes. Oh my goodness. This is, I know it's really tough for you guys to see. Okay, which <laughs> camera am I on? I'm on five. So I'm going to try, oh Rich, I don't know if this is gonna work because it's actually down here. Exactly. Oh, you know what, I can, I, maybe I can do this. You can see there the, it is. there it is. There's the uh, station. See, it, I know it's, there we go, look yes. at that. Yes, yes. And, and as Allison was saying, this is in, oh, what happened here? It's <laughs> hair user. <laughs> uh, it's right there. So in the Southern Hemisphere, that is really awesome. Um, tell us about the, Space Center's involvement in this app. Mm, yes, yeah. so there's a reason why Houston is the space city. Yes, uh, it's home to Johnson Space Center, mm -hmm. which houses multiple human space flight programs and projects. And that includes the International Space Station Program Office. Uh, so the calculations that this app uses uh, actually occur right here in Houston wow. at Mission Control Center. So there's quite the collaboration between oh, the two. Oh, 100%, yeah. 100%, yes. That's really awesome. If you've never been uh, to um, the Johnson Space Center, yes. go visit. Oh, please, yes, it's wonderful. Before here, I lived in Florida, and uh, so when family would come to visit from New York, I'd bring them down to Kennedy, and now yes. that I'm here, we, we go down to Johnson. So oh, I love it. They get experience both. Yeah, it's really awesome. Um, yeah. For people interested in... Um, you know, exploring this a little more. Any other fun features they, they can do, they can see? Well, we have uh, an about feature on the app where you can actually read about 
uh, what's going on on the International Space Station right now, oh, all wow. the latest news. Um, and we've even got a details page. I don't know if you can see it, but it talks about the latitude, the longitude, the altitude, uh, average number of crew members. Where am I? There on you board. Are, there we five, go. Yes. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah, I know <laughs> it's go. a little tricky. Yeah. Uh, but there's lots of cool features here, lots to explore. Uh, take your kids outside, show them the pinpoint glow across the ah, sky. It's so, really amazing. So neat. And I will say that um, we even have sighting opportunity tonight. Okay. At 6:07 p.m. Okay. Uh, so download the app. The app will notify you, and hopefully the skies are clear, and we'll get a great view of the International Space Station yeah, from well, Houston. Yeah, we're about to find out if the skies are going to be clear. But just this reminder: uh, if you are interested in downloading the app, we've put a direct link inside this story on our website. Wonderful. Click to Houston.com.